Welcome to Suerte del Molino, a farm in Andalusia, Spain. We have two water tanks, this inflatable one, 100,000 liters, and this fiberglass one, 10,000 liters. And um, let's see where we can irrigate or water or supply water from here. I will follow this latest addition coming from the red gate valve to the red ball valve coming down here so from this square water tank the water came from down here by pump solar electricity um, and now by gravity it is going down to almost the same place where it comes from but it taps into our western uh, irrigation system this is it so I can water the western part of the land by using the existing irrigation system. Uh, ipso facto, for what it really comes to, I can also put this water into this uh, cistern and then I can pump it to the other side if I want to. Okay, let's go back up there from this inflatable tank there is a 32 millimeter pipe and from the round water tank it's also a 32 millimeter pipe both of them going down towards the house the one from the round tank must be a meter or a half uh, below the surface because I made these swales and I didn't find it and uh, it was done by the previous owner and the new owner has it 15 centimeters deep because he's lazy and uh, so two lines Two pipelines coming down, the one just where the dog structure is, it goes towards the house. That's what we use for the water in the house. With that water we can also irrigate the garden and also this lower part of the uh, farm if we have to it's all connected and uh, that's why I'm basically making this video because the next person coming after me hopefully not soon will have no freaking idea what it's all about okay this one comes from the green squared inflatable water tank. That one comes from the round water tank. Both of them go to this garden, this whole area. And I can also use this pipe and link up to the irrigation system. It will not push it up but everything that is low. The water up there, the water from the round water tank that gets its water from the well. Also comes this way. I can water all this 
uh, cuttings here and our growing uh, propagation section and there's also water right into the tent also electricity yeah good luck to anybody to un unravel this intricate system but basically uh, we store water as high as possible we get the water from two sources the well and the cistern and then we try to in interconnect these systems so that the water can be used when and how we need it to happen that is it for the series on water underground the cute thing I found out about water the only time it moves uh, vertically is when it falls out of the sky and the rest of its life it is horizontal and that is exactly what we need and we need to know and also there is no new water on earth and there's no disappearance of water so it's a close loop close circuit so water is water is water but once it hits the land it flows horizontal on top of the land and underneath till next time goodbye